15 to 20 centimeters. Niagara, you're not included in the snowfall warning. You're still going to see snow, but it will be under the criteria, which is 15 centimeters of snow or more in 12 hours or less. But we're seeing all areas of southern Ontario starting to mix in with that snow. The snow will continue. The makeup of the system is still a large storm system, but once again, it has lost a, a few little elements in it that would make it even worse. One thing's for certain, though, it's still tapping into the Atlantic moisture, and that moisture is being pulled from the jet stream all the way into southern Ontario where it collides with the colder air, which the end result will be the heavy snowfall, which is very slow-moving snowfall because of the overall slow movement of our low-pressure system itself. It basically sticks just south of the lower Great Lakes through the day on Wednesday, and all the heavier snow will be experienced through the pre-dawn hours of your Wednesday. We're still expecting light snow to continue off and on through the day on Wednesday, even into the evening commute. We're still up with flurries from the same system on Thursday with highs near two, maybe an additional centimeter locally. But once we finally lose that system on Friday, temperatures will back off a little bit, but high pressure will be moving in, which eliminates the chance for active weather through the weekend and into the beginning stages of the, uh, the, the work week next week. But right now, we're dealing with these big flakes of snow. The wet snow continues all night long, and there will be accumulations, and it is very slushy. If you're curious, slush is still slippery. Back to you. Okay, yeah. thanks so much for that.